All right, with gas prices up more than a dollar a gallon compared to this time last year, drivers are keeping a close eye on the pump. Kang on nine on your side, Zanel Confair investigates how several gas stations here in southern Arizona were put out of service after charging customers for gas they were not getting in the end. In a time of inflation, many families are watching every dollar they spend, but according to the Arizona Department of Agriculture's Weights and Measures Services Division, some pumps weren't pumping out what customers were paying for. The customer didn't get the full amount of fuel that they paid for. Um, when we arrived at the station, the fuel dispenser was bagged out of service in response to the complaint. In the past two months, his division has found three gas violations here in southern Arizona where customers were getting overcharged at the pump. The first gas station at Quick Trip off Craycroft and River was off by negative 18 cubic inches. Speedway off Speedway Boulevard off by negative 8 cubic inches and Circle K off Prince and Romero was also off by negative 8 cubic inches. So what does that equate to? For gas pumps off by negative 8 cubic inches going off Arizona's average cost of a gallon of gas at 442, you would lose about a 15th of a cent per gallon. For the pump that was off negative 18 cubic inches, customers would lose around a third of a cent. While it may cost some customers small change, Kevin Allen says they're determined to make sure they keep the industry accountable. Our, our rate on meter inaccuracy is still less than 1% of the time, but you know, for each individual consumer, um, you know, it could be that transaction where something happens with the pump, some abnormal performance, or that could be the meter that for whatever reason is out of calibration. When filling up on gas, he says to make sure the pump starts at zero. And if you have a complaint, you can contact his office. Their number located on each gas pump here in Arizona. So basically, if the pump doesn't start on zero, whatever that amount is between zero and where the jump stops uh, is uh, the amount of fuel that the customer is not receiving in their tank. And so it could put the measurement out of tolerance uh, to where it's detrimental to the consumer. For more information on filing a complaint, head to kega9.com. Didel Confair, Kega 9, on your side.